Hey guys, I'm gonna keep it back here for that video, guys. Today we have it, the all-time Tennessee Titan squad build, and this is 50 out of 50 Tennessee Titans. So let's get started right away. Now I am I do not have DeAndre Hopkins or AJ Brown. And Josh Reynolds is also on this team, but he's not on the auction house. So I can't actually get Josh Reynolds. So I'll be honest with you, you know, looking at all the theme teams we have so far, also running backs, they have Adrian Peterson and Devon Dante Foreman. So they have 290 overall running backs. Plus, of course, again, like I said, they have an 85 overall receiver, a 90, and an 89 overall receiver. This is probably one of the best team teams in Madden. Like, overall-wise, they own it in 82, but the offense is absolutely juiced. They have an 84 tight end, 81 tight end, and a 72. Their line is actually pretty good. I mean, I can max him out to an 89 overall if I wanted to. And again, like overall wise, the running backs are great. The receivers are great. There's really nothing wrong with this offense. The defense, I will say overall wise, you can get a Monty Hooker here to a 90. There's another 85 overall, Bud Dupree. You can get a left outside linebacker. The rights are correct. Middle linebacker is correct here. Free safeties are correct. Um, I have the best secondary you can get outside of Roger McGrary. He has a 77 overall card. I have a 875 here, but you can get a 77 overall. Um, the line, we got Clowney, we got Simmons, we got, you know, Tart. It's like a weird theme team because, again, like I said, if you get the fully maxed out offense, it could easily win. A lot of games in this game. I'm sorry, a lot of games online without any hassle at all. I mean, you have a pretty dang good quarterback. He was still very good, uh, you know, even in late October here. 85 speed, plenty good speed, plenty good throw accuracy, 88 throw power, a little, you know, not too crazy good. But at the same time, you know, look at the cards that are coming out today. They're, that's not really bad at all. The running back, by the way, just shout out to the fact I never got my final like collectible for this to max out Derrick Henry. I'm not sure like what I was supposed to do. I know there was a glitch where EA wasn't giving out that final collectible, but not sure why I didn't I never got it other than just EA being EA. Because I did all the solos, I did all the objective lists, but never got that collectible. So probably just EA, you know, glitching as always. Uh, but like I said before, you can even get uh, Dante Foreman here, who has 91 speed, 93 speed when he is maxed out. Adrian Peterson, 93 speed when he's maxed out with his theme team. So you can really just create yourself a God Squad based on the Titans theme team. And based on what we've seen from other theme teams, that's not really the case. I mean, you can't really do that with other theme teams we have built. I, I like to go ahead and poke fun or point at... The Cincinnati Bengals theme team, and that's actually um, is that the Patriots theme team. Okay, I don't think I have the Bengals theme team actually queued up here. Um, here's the Patriots theme team, right? And I like to poke fun at the Patriots theme team because, it's like, you know, they have. They're I forgot how good their offense actually was, but you know they're not like. That offense. I mean, they're not like three running backs are the best in the game. And all three receivers are three are pretty much the best in the game receivers. Right? So, the Patriots are a bad example, man. The Patriots are a really good theme team, too. But, nonetheless, though, going back to my original example, though. I mean, it's a very good theme team, right? And there's not every single theme team in the game you're going to be able to run at max level. And feel like you could actually win online without any hassle at all. I think somebody commented on my last video and said like, Oh, I've won the Patriots theme team. And I actually, you know, I won a Super Bowl with it. And again, listen, at the end of the day, you can win a Super Bowl with a lot of different theme teams. Right? If you're a good enough Madden player and you know how to play Madden, you can win a theme team with a lot of different theme teams in the game. I'm not going to argue that. It's just that it gets more and more difficult when you go down the rabbit hole of different theme teams. Because then you get to a point where you're like, I don't know if this theme team is going to be good enough for me, right? Because, like, let's say hypothetically speaking, right? So right now I'm rocking 50 at 50, right? I could, in theory, right, put Jamar Chase in my kick and punt returner, okay? I could put, you know, maybe not Jason Kelsey here. 
but look at what's the what's the problem with you know the steam team. Okay, well the problem with the steam team right now is left guard, right? If you go back, left guard's the problem. You get a good left guard, and this steam team is complete. I mean, if you wanted to technically cheat, you could do this. Put you know your kicker. You could put your best kicker you have. So let's say McManus right there. And then what you could do is actually just sub in some other guys. So you probably wouldn't do receiver because this team, if you have maxed out, you have like the best receiving core. But you could even put in, so if I asked a linebacker, for example, I don't think you could put that on a kick or punt return. Uh, kick and punt return, I might actually just keep it as the set theme team players. And here's the reason why, because I would want to use them on the specialist here. So you could even say like, okay, well, halfbacks maxed out, right? Receiving core is maxed out too. You're probably not messing with that. But before it comes to defensive line, because this is a fully maxed out defensive line, you might say, well, my D tackle I don't really like. So you might say, okay, I'm going to put Aaron Donald in here, right? And all you have to do is once you go into a theme or a game, just, you know, best team available and all these guys will sub in. So you can say, I want Trey Hendrickson in there, you know, and as long as you have like, what, five extra spots after you max it out 55 man roster, because 55 spots you can have on a team. So 55 different players can have a team. 50 are Titans, obviously. But if you really wanted to, you could even go in here and you know, add some other players. So, for example, if you're like, well, you know, kicker and punter, or sorry, kicker isn't really that big of a deal for me, you could even take out the kicker and say, okay, well, I'm just going to go with the theme team kicker because I know I'll score touchdowns and I don't have to worry about kicking, right? So now you have an extra spot to put another player in that you wanted to to kind of, you know, keep that God squad S going even when you have a theme team. So again, there's always ways to kind of work around a theme team where you can even put in other players. So for example, now I have the theme team, all Titans, but I also have Jarrell Revis. I can put, so my secondary now is Revis, Sean Murphy, Bunting, and Adore, ja Adore Jackson. Even though I do have maxed out, you know, obviously maxed out theme team i also have those other players now i can put in there and actually utilize in the game so again there's always ways to kind of get around you know have a theme team but also have a god squad in aspect right and if you max this out fully you're going to have that god squad no matter what so again just a little quick tips and tricks right there i know some people do that already but not everybody knows that not everybody you know rocks with the uh, theme teams but if you are thinking about doing a theme team I have, I think this is our 17th or 18th theme team on the channel. Make sure you go check out the playlist. Look, check out the channel, check out the playlist, and see all the good theme team, you know, teams you can create. Because there are a lot of good theme teams out there. And they, if you're like, well, I don't want to do it because I want to have a God Squad, you can always look at those theme teams. A lot of them have God Squads pretty much. And you can even add, you know, to the specialist position and kind of manipulate around that. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.